working for Tally Valley, which is a nightlife video magazine. What's your name? I'm Gracie Mayer. Chelsea Nutt. And I hear that you are the manager of Painted Ladies, right? I am. I was the, uh, the owner, I'm the founder, and I'm the one that started it. And I have one of my main founding dancers here with me as well. Awesome. How long have you been dancing with her? Since the very beginning, so probably about a year and a half, I would say. Awesome. When did the show was actually here? It was a year ago. It was for Diplo. It was back when it was 2020. It was for Diplo, and um, a lot has changed since then. Yeah. We have a lot more paint on us, and a lot more, a uh, lot more coverage. But um, we've still been dancing here, even though it's changed a lit. Right. How would you compare 2020 and lit? Like, what would you say is has made it better? I mean, I think ever since they had the transformation, it's been a lot more Miami style. Um, a lot more uh, modern, classy, better lights. I hear girls complimenting the bathroom sinks all the time. <laughs> so, I mean, you, you can pretty much tell everything's changed. Right. What about you? Like, did you used to go to 2020? You danced there. How would you compare it? I did used to go there. I would say overall, it's definitely been an improvement. For sure, yeah. I mean, even with, with last year and the AC broke, but when it was 2020, that was when we danced for Benny Benassi. And the girls were so hot, the paint dripped off of them within minutes. The nipple covers fell off. It was bad. So even the AC in here is better, you know, and that matters a lot in the summer. Oh, yeah, no, definitely. How did it all start? Like, when did you decide to, like, have the painted ladies start performing in Tallahassee? Are you, like, originally from here? Well, I'm from the Jersey Shore originally. Hi. So, of course, I love it. Nikki! Um, but no, me and Chelsea started painting our faces for Menace back at the engine room okay. and people started liking it So we thought let's just do the whole body. Why not? And um, ever since ever since the Diplo show here last year It's been just growing and growing and we've done stuff Fort Lauderdale, Louisiana, New Orleans um, All over so how long have you been doing it for? I've been body painting. Um, I started for photo shoots about four or five years ago And I've um, i just I'm actually about to graduate grad school so it's very exciting. I'm moving to New Orleans. Hey. Wait, so it's your senior year right now, right? I'm actually in grad school. So it's my last week of grad school. Hell, but you know, it's what are you gonna do with your major? Um, well, it's an art therapy major. Okay. So it's kind of what I love to do already, but helping people with it too. Look at you. Like she looks so hot right now. I'm like a cartoon guy. Hey. <laughs> Glowing in the dark. And Chelsea's still going to be one of my main dancers, even though we're going to be doing it a little bit less frequently. We actually haven't told anyone about it yet. Okay. We're going to be doing it still, but instead of an every week thing, we're going to do it three or four times a year for big major events like festivals and stuff like that. Do you like Day Glow and stuff like that? Um, Chelsea and Allison dance at Day Glow, although they weren't painted. Um, but we've done other things on that scale with that kind of stage, but we haven't done Day Glow yet. Although we do love the committee boys. We'll come up for sure. <laughs> Hopefully in your future. Yeah. What would you say is like your most memorable time? So you've been doing it for like a couple of years, right? Where would you say is your favorite place and most memorable moment doing it? My most memorable moment would be at Rivalry, which the committee boys also put on. That was last October, November. It was by far the best show. It was 30 degrees. I was completely naked dancing on stage. But overall, best show I've ever done. For sure. So, what would you say is your favorite club to perform at? Favorite club? This one. This one all the way. Late night clubs. We bet you get your ass here. <laughs> For sure. So it's been like how many years? Uh, the Painted Ladies started out as the Tallahassee Painted Ladies. Okay. And now we've transferred to just the Painted Ladies because it's not going to be only in Tallahassee. It's been going on for about a year and a half now. It's been a year and a half in progress. And it started out where we were begging, please let us do a show for free. And now we get actual some money to reimburse for supplies and everything, travel and whatnot. So, sure. yeah, it's a where, true. Yeah, no, that's awesome. Where would you see yourself 10 years from now? Like, what do you want to be doing? Do you see this, like, developing? I would love to keep doing this um, as a few times a year thing. Obviously, as a career, it's probably not too realistic, but... Um, Ten years from now, I could be living on a houseboat in Amsterdam. I could be in a nudist colony in Spain. Who knows? Obviously, hopefully it'll be somewhere exotic, and I'll have a good tan and some neon on me. So, so are you, like, a dancer besides um, dancing for her? Or? Yes, I've been dancing my whole life since I was four years old. Um, 
When we got involved with TPL, I was actually teaching ballroom dance at Fred Astaire Dance Studio. And I mean, I have other dance experience. I danced um, as a professional cheerleader for the Panthers in Albany, Georgia, along with other things, but those are my main gigs. Oh, yeah. Well, thank you, ladies, so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> no problem. Last night out in Tallahassee really before I'm moving, and um, I'm just. Hi, you just in time. Perfect timing, right before we walk in and all the sweat starts to come. It's very... I mean, I can't miss you. I'm like, hey, like, I need that bright thing right over here. My mom got this for me as a Christmas ornament, like, two years ago. And I said, mom, no, no. It's a necklace. Right. And ever since then, it's been my grace bling, so... Like your, yeah, I my go-to name tag. Your favorite accessory. Like, you gotta wear it. It's your name. For sure. <laughs> Yeah. You, see, you look loud and like you stand out, you look awesome. You can't forget it. My mom said, oh no, Grace, the boys are going to look right at your chest. Like, oh. We're from Jersey, they do that anyway. But thank you very much, it's been a pleasure. Thank you so much. I'm sure I will see, be seeing you more, seeing both of you guys more. So yeah, People look out for us. Um, you know, we'll, we'll be back in Tallahassee eventually, but um, it's going to be more of a spread out thing all over the southeast. So keep a look out. We've got a Facebook page, The Painted Ladies can like it and uh, we'll, we'll uh, be posting this video when it comes out. Awesome. You guys check out Painted Ladies. Is it Facebook.com? It's Facebook.com slash Painted in Neon. Awesome. Mario, thank you ladies. Hope you all have awesome your, your last